They just called me. My dad died. I said, hey, now, somebody have to die for you to make it. I can use your destiny to make it. Come on, God, you will shut, shut up your mouth. If you like, I have all the talent. Be smart. You will still suffer. You will still not be successful. All right, so I made a post some minutes ago uh, where I talked about how my wife literally gave me money for me to do prayers and rituals for her. But before I continue, let me show you the last wine my wife bought for me to do libation for her. But then I'd already bought one to do for her. Let me show you the wine. Good. I'm not going to show you the name of the wine, but this, it's a rose Italian sparkling wine. My wife literally bought this wine for 6,000, this is 6,000 something, I can't remember. One of the major reasons why I made that post was for me to tell you people that there is nothing you want in this life except you have some form of sacrifice or payment for it, meaning nothing actually comes free no even the beggar by the street is working for him to get somebody to help him now somebody came to my comment section and he said the person of ochuko he said i don't know why i had a hard time believing things like this when you go down he said by combining effort with smart thinking i think anyone can develop that kind of mindset that helps them to be as successful as possible somebody who is a nigerian living in nigeria someone who understands the economy and the life structure in Nigeria and Africa to be precise would make this kind of post saying efforts and smart thinking make people rich and successful you're lying because I replied him and I said somebody is reading your post now sitting inside a bus from Ikorodu or Oshodi or Ikeja or somewhere Ikoyi or Abulegba to Ibejuleki or even Ekbe closing from office this person is likely to be the most productive staff in his or her office this person is a good marketer this person is a programmer this person is good in digital marketing but you know what you know them in lagos now digital marketers you know they wear trousers they wear backpack you know, they are very very smart they know how to set facebook adverts but i tell you their salaries in lagos yo the highest paid because i was one i worked for zilox yes and i only worked for one month because they did not pay me unknown to me they said it was a contract they signed with somebody else who employed me they are never get the sense eh? actually people actually work for real estate people as staff and they employ others under them to work for them for them to meet up what targets and that was the case and they were like, was the person that employed me and at the end of the day they work smart they are very good in what they do but their salary is not even up to fifty thousand naira. when i know what's not the talk i have met a lot of people in the course of my life smart and intelligent but they were suffering one came to meet me in asaba and i said you can't stay in asaba i said what i said no you cannot stay in fact that was the time my spirituality started coming up and i prayed for him this guy is good in programming was working as a teacher part-time teacher for NIIT, but there was no money. And the spirit minister told me, tell him to move to Lagos. I was in Asaba suffering. I was editing news content that beat CNN. And I'm still telling you, I, Uzi Ben, I edit news content, graphics news content that beat CNN. As of 2016, people were watching my content and they were saying, this is more than CNN standard to the core. But I was hungry. And I told Cyril, go. To Lagos, Siri applied. I prayed for Siri. Siri is in Victoria Island, any more than 600,000 a month. What happened? Are you telling me there are no people that do better work than Siri? There are smart people that work more than Siri, but they are suffering. If you like, have all the talent, be smart, you will still suffer, you will still not be successful. What I can tell you that can guarantee your success is how you are 100%, even if not up to 100%, but 90% spiritually in control of yourself. You see a Nigerian man or Chuko who does not know even one ritual in Illuminati, does not know one ritual in free mercy, does not understand a particular ritual in Rosicrucian order, yet all the billionaires we hear of on earth today, successful people in, in Nigeria and across the world, they are either 33 degree members, they are 10 degree members, they are first degree members, they are members of the free mercy, they are members of the Illuminati, they are members of the Rosicrucian orders. You think myself that floated the water religion, you don't know what I'm doing? Do you know the number of rituals and deep secrets I go to inquire on world creation so that I can have my followers as 
as parts of the image makers, billionaires we have in Africa, using the African spirituality. Do you know sacrifices I make every day? And then 100 years coming, you now stay in the water religion, and then they control Africa. You will now start accusing pastors who are not members of the water religion. You guys will now start calling the water religion a secret society, who the man has built it, the foundation has already been made. If you like, be smart and intelligent without spirituality, you are going nowhere. Ochuko. We have talented musicians. We have people who sing better than Davido. Sing better than Whiskey. Sing better than most artists you see in Nigeria. But they are still in Islam. There is no opportunity for them. You say smart thinking. Who, who do you not think smart? What is smart thinking? Be submissive. Some don't submit. Tire. Follow instructions. Some don't follow. Tire. I work for Honorable Barrister Victor Oche from 2007 up to 2013 yes i was working under ikemosu nothing was coming out a night i woke up and i took the earth of Oka and i spoke and i called onto the spirit of the earth it is time for you to favor me the following day there was no money in my account i was smart i was good some of the adverts you see by victor oche 2017 and eight election i did those adverts how much did they give me the highest money was ten thousand naira. oh Somebody else was eating the money. Obviously, <laughs> the person is already blessed. When I made that prayer, Kemosu called me. Come, something happened. Because the moment you key into spirituality, you know what happened? They will cause problems for someone so that you will be elevated. And the king told Vachi, come and display your beauty to my friends. Vachi said no. Vachi has to be engulfed with the spirit of disobedience so that Esther can come on top of the throne. Saul has to be given the spirit of ignorance and disobedience so that David can come up. The brothers of Joseph has to be envious so that Joseph can come up. Somebody have to go down for another person to come up. And that is what I do in the water religion. I bring people down for me to go up. And I teach my followers how to bring people down for them to go up. This month is November. Tomorrow, we are having the death ritual. The moon water ritual. The death ritual. And everybody that is going to be involved in that ritual must have a covenant that somebody must go down in their family for them to go up. And that person, me that person, in fact, you are watching me and you know one of your brother is a member of the water. Start having good mind. I mean, start praying for the person to be successful. Any slight envy towards anyone that will do that ritual, the person is going down. My son called me. He said, sir, after the death ritual, they just called me. My dad died. I said, hey, now, somebody have to die for you to make it. He said, what about the spirit? I said, the spirit cannot worry you. If your father died, it means he was having evil against you. And the moment the father died, the spirit of the father started disturbing. I said, come on, God, you will shut, shut up your mouth. And the spirit of the father instructed the uncle to continue the war and i told the man do this ritual do this ritual and warn your uncle if he if he ever continue on that mission of bringing you down he will die and guess what the uncle was warned the uncle hesitated guess what hours were still coming to take the life of this boy and the boy traveled to where to asaba for what a party i knew something was happening i called him do this do that he said no problem something ministered to the boy the boy went to make the cloth everybody's making he made his own white and designed the watered logo on the cloth. The bead I gave him when I traveled to Abuja was the bead he wore and he had an accident, a very fatal accident. Only the bead and son were the ones that were crushed. Nothing happened to him. Let me tell you, I am begging you to remain ignorant because it is only in your ignorance I can make money. It is only in your ignorance I can use your destiny to make it. It is only in your ignorance I need your star. Those that subscribe to the Uzi Ben Spiritual Forum, I told them, start looking for people who are what? Ignorant. Because the truth is it, some of you may not be able to use your star. You need other people's star. I'm starting a lecture in the WhatsApp group that you refuse to pay for. How to use sex to take people's destiny and stars. And how to detect when somebody is using sex to take your destiny and star. And how to actually make it via sex. Let me tell you, you don't know anything. So keep quiet. The world is where it is today because blood were shared. The world is where it is today because some people we are ignorant. Africa is where it is today because we are still ignorant. The white man that you think is all technology was the same white man that was sacrificing bull, cow, goat in Onitsha, in Delta State in Lagos so that they can build bridges. Do you know how many animal sacrifices that we have sacrificed? Even Julius Beggar, all of them. They know people that are in charge of the spiritual sacrifices or else bridge cannot pass. Go and ask, they will tell you. So, Oga Ochuko, that you think I said my wife pay me money so that doors can open for her for me to do ritual. It's true. I'm not lying. She pays. And there is somebody I also give money as offering so that my doors can be open because sometimes we need 
chase each other stars for us to make it. It's only the foolish one that go poor. There will always be poor among us. My question is this. Must you be the poor? Thank you. God bless. In the ancient waters and the ancient spirits protect us, guide us, shield us from the eyes of the envious one. Both humans, animals and spirits are shared.